guys, it's Malia Taylor. It's officially spooky season, which means I'm gonna be doing the classic makeup look. This week is gonna be Carnage. I'm gonna try put of my own little twist on it. You'll see. But here we go. I'm pretty nervous because we're starting off with a pretty difficult look. I got my makeup over here and let's get started. So I'm still wearing what I wore last night. Oops. So I have a fan behind me, so if you hear that, I'm sorry, but it's way too hot to go without it. First thing I'm gonna do is take off the makeup that I slept in last night. I just got this yesterday in the mail. It is reusable makeup remover pad, so I'm gonna give this a try and see how good these are. And it's good because there's like a bunch of pads that come in here, and then when they're all dirty and used up, you just throw it in this bag and throw it in the wash, I think. I feel like I could have made these myself, but oh well. My setup today is pretty sketchy, so if things fall over or things drop and move around, I apologize. I've been having the hardest time trying to figure out exactly what kind of makeup looks I want to do, because I want to do something that hasn't been overdone, but yet something that you recognize. This isn't the best makeup remover, I mean, it feels nice and everything. I'm using the micellar water. So I mean, it's not the best, you kind of have to work with it. I really have no procedure of how I'm going to accomplish this today, so this will be interesting. I didn't even like watch any videos or anything, I've watched maybe like a quick little clip of a video, but I never watched the whole thing through, so I might end up having to pause and watch a video. It's okay, it's bound to happen. I actually am going to end up using a q-tip and see if that helps take off this mascara because I'm going to need this area completely white, so I want to take off all the makeup. Some eyelashes are being sacrificed as well. Okay, I'm going to finish taking off the mascara and then I'll be right back. This is going to make a huge mess. I, I can feel it. So I think I'm just kind of going to map out where I want everything to go. I haven't done this in so long, so it's so nerve-wracking to make like any kind of movement on it. I think I should have glued my eyebrows first, so I'll do that now. I thought this was gray and I was like, what is gray paint doing in my white paint? So I was trying to wipe it out and it's the pan. Do you find that I've been sniffling a lot throughout this video? I mean, I'll be editing it so hopefully all the sniffles will be taken out, but I've been having some kind of sinus problem for almost a year now. I don't really know what it's from. I got like sick one time and ever since then it hasn't been the same. So basically I have a hard time breathing out of my right nose, so I'm always like sniffling to try to get the airflow. The picture that I'm looking at for reference is like a comic book picture of him. Casey chair. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest off camera just so I can get the angles right. There's a lot of like tight spaces I have to fill in, but yeah, I'm gonna go do that off camera and then I'll be right back. Making progress. It still looks pretty patchy, so I have to touch everything up later on. Oh my god, this stuff is so buttery, so good.
gonna put on the last finishing touches and I will be right back with the final reveal. Okay you guys, that pretty much completes this look. So I wanted to go for a more comic version of Carnage and then I kind of wanted to incorporate it with the comic type of makeup look that a lot of people have been doing. So this is the final result. Not as detailed as like a realistic Carnage um, makeup, but I didn't want to get ahead of myself. I'm really happy with this paint palette. It definitely came through, so excited to do some more looks for you guys. I'm like blind in this eye right now, so it's a little strange, but hope you guys enjoyed this look. I know I definitely did. If you did, be sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.